Take a good look at Potomac, boys. Or take your choice and look at Lieutenant Juanita Redmond, the redhead. Or her pal, Captain Ruthie Parsons of the Army Nurse Corps. Who are these young ladies? Take a good look. Have a good listen. Juanita, do you think much about Baton and Corregidor these days? Oh, yes. Sometimes it seems as though I left Corregidor last week instead of a year ago. I bet you're glad to get out of that place. No, really, it's heartbreaking to leave those girls and boys behind. Where were you on December 7th? I was in Manoa, except December 8th, 14 time. I was on light duty when I heard the Japanese had bombed Pearl Harbor. But even then, I thought it'd be some time before they started in on us. But the same day Pearl Harbor was bombed, the Jap planes came over Manoa. They took everyone by surprise. Panic stricken, many people lost their heads. After the first raid, the Japs came back day after day. The damage was horrible. The day before Christmas, we were ordered to Bataan to set up field hospitals. And along the roadside, I saw the results of the Jap bombs. Natives trying to save their belongings were strafed on open roads. There was no singing of carols that Christmas Eve. After the town, I was transferred to Corregidor across the bay. Finally, six days before Corregidor fell, I was evacuated to Australia. This Japanese film has come into our hands, and vividly it brings back the days I spent on Corregidor. I know how desperately our men fought. By the time I left, munitions, food, and supplies were practically gone. As General MacArthur said, Never did an army do so much with so little. We all lived in tunnels like this under the constant bombardment of Jap planes and guns. This Jap movie shows the enemy climbing up the embankment for the last attack. They hit Corregidor with every man and gun they had in the Philippines. And they were a merciless enemy. I had just arrived in Australia when I heard of our surrender on May 7th, five months after Pearl Harbor. I know how our boys hated this moment. I knew a lot of them well, many of them I had nursed in our hospital. They fought until they had nothing left to fight with. It must have been heartbreaking for General Wainwright, our commanding officer, whom we all loved, when he had to meet General Loma, commander of the Jap forces. The Japs must be proud of this scene. And they must be proud of their general. Yes, Manila, the town, Corregidor, all in Jap hands now. The news is different this year. Chris, I wish those men of ours that are held prisoners by the chaps could know that the help that they've waited for for so long is well on the way and that they're not forgotten. You're damned right they know, Lieutenant. Help is on the way. The kind of help we wish we could have sent them when their back was against the wall on Bataan and Corregidor. But it took time and sweat to build those ships, which are pushing their way across the Pacific today in ever-increasing numbers. And it took months of training to build a fighting army, too. But now we're rolling. Now GIs from Atlanta and El Paso, Green Bay and Three Rivers, are jamming the docks of Melbourne and Sydney. Guys and fighting equipment from the USA, down under to do a little job. Guadalcanal, Buna, at two. That was only a beginning, Lieutenant. Only a beginning. Up in Coscarp, Connecticut, Harry Powers and his wife, they lived down on Suburban Avenue, took the auto out of their garage and put in a heap of machinery. Young Dick Powers and his kid brother keep the place tidied up so as their father, Harry Powers, can get right to work in the garage making machine tools on subcontracts for the big airplane plants around Coscarp. 
The government calls this a four-man shop, Harry says. They don't count me and Mrs. Powers, but we work here too. They count Gene Salvatore, though. Gene goes to high school, but he comes to work at the garage just as soon as school lets out. And they count Joe the milkman. There ain't been a day since the plant opened that Joe ain't showed up. One job ain't enough for him. When Joe gets through delivering milk to the people in Coscob, he drives over to the garage, takes off his white coat, and gets to work. Joe and Gene used to be on the same bowling team, but ain't no time for bowling now. Sometimes the milk truck's parked out in front of the garage, 10, 11 o'clock at night while Joe's working this late. Ever since Pearl Harbor, Harry and his helpers been working 16, 17 hours a day making these machine tools. Tweezers, yokes, buck and bars, riveting anvils, pneumatic hammer jaws, reamers, hinge pins, the machine tools they make airplanes with keep coming out of the Powers garage six days a week, 16, 17 hours a day. When Mrs. Powers ain't housekeeping or cooking for the men, she's down working with them. It's the same for the boys when they get home from school. Except on Sundays, none of them get any time off. Once Harry figured he needed a rest, he went off on a fishing trip, but he couldn't sit still long enough to catch fish. And he came home the next day and went to work. But when the Powers are expecting a visitor, they get cleaned up. Particularly if the visitor is James Forrestal, who's Under Secretary of the Navy down Washington. Mr. Forrestal came to Cost Cobb because he wanted to see Harry Powers and his wife and his sons and his helpers. He wanted to give them the Army-Navy E for excellence. It wasn't much of a day for weather, chilly with a good breeze coming off the sound. I think there is no occasion about which, in which I have participated that I have had more pleasure and more pride in my country than to being able to give you this symbol. I congratulate you. Now the powers don't take much time off, as I've said, but when you get a big flag from the government, you want to sort of break it out. And the flag looks mighty pretty to the family, flying over their garage down on Suburban Avenue. The same flag that's flying over other wall plants, a thousand times bigger than the Powers' place. But they don't hang around for more than the feast. They get back to work. 